we are getting ready to do a tour of a chocolate factory here in Daytona and it's right behind us called Angel and Phelps Chocolate Factory. Let's go check it out. We have never been down to this area before in Daytona, but it looks nice and new. Right over here, we have Angel and Phelps Chocolate Factory. Um, online it said you can go in and do a free like 20 minute tour of how they make uh, the chocolates. Right there, yeah. Fine chocolates, fine chocolates, free factory tours, fine chocolates. It's super nice over here. Definitely excited for this. Let's go in and check it out. It says Monday through Saturday, 9.30 to 5, Sunday closed. Look right here. Let's go in. Oh, it smells very good in here. It smells like chocolate. They got some cards you can buy. Look at this little card. Here's some chocolate they have. Look at that. Daytona Beach. $17.49 for a big chocolate box. This is awesome. Just kind of doing an overview. They're playing Christian music in the background. Restrooms are over here. There's a lot of chocolate in this place. Oh, bacon? Oh, bacon. Of course, they've got this wall with a ton of stuff on it, too. It's a hopping place. Oh, look at these crosses. Here are some fantastic fudge facts. Kind of go slow so you can read all that. Check out where it was started. Hi, do you want anything Just, looking, Just right looking now? Just looking now. Yes, probably. Probably, probably sometime. <laughs> Thank you. Chocolate covered strawberries. This side's dark chocolate, that side's milk chocolate. Gonna walk back here because this is where sugar free chocolate. So they've got sugar free, dark chocolate, milk chocolate. So they do have shipping. That's interesting. Please no merchandise beyond this point. And then back here is where you can do the free little tour of seeing how they do everything. Hey, we have this. We have this Ten Commandments sign right here. Look at this. Oh, okay. Chocolate is the answer. So you can literally just, oh, try our famous pralines. You can literally just walk back here and look at everything they're doing. Look at this. This is so cool. Little airplanes. Owls. It's pro they probably say it's a 20 minute tour because you can take your own time. So if you just sit here and look at everything. Oh, look at those. Chocolate covered chips back there. Oh, potato Sweet. chips, yeah. So you got a bunch of stuff going on over here. Kind of do a slow pan of everything. There's some caramel apples. Yeah, caramel apples are good. And then we'll finish this window down here and then come down and they've got some like newspapers and stuff on the wall. This is a big 
chocolate place. We were talking about you yesterday. We were. Because <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I see the twinkle. Yeah. 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 And then over on this side, she's got some little, I don't know if these are like old. Maybe like old flyers or menus. Sweet tooth for quality. Interesting. So you can see this is the little alleyway we came down and you can just take your time and look through all that they're doing. It's really cool that they do this. This is awesome. You got a little chocolate humor here. When in doubt, take another bite, it says. Kind of reminds me of the chocolate. Oh, yeah. Kind of reminds me. And that looks like chocolate. Look. The Chocolate Emporium at City Walk, one of our favorite restaurants. Kind of reminds me of that. Look at all these. We're definitely going to have to try some. I'm going to go back to the front here and try to show you the rest of the chocolates. I didn't see the shirts. Look at the shirts they've got. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. John 3, 16. One of the most famous verses in the Bible. Quick hide the chocolate in my mouth. Hey, look at these. Jesus saved shirts. This place is awesome. Oh, and that's on the back of the Jesus saved shirts. Yeah. And over here they have a... Um, you can write down some prayer requests. That's cool. Heading back into the little shop, and we are going to show you now what their cases have. If if it's not too crowded, I don't want to get in people's way. But again, here's the sugar-free one. And then on over here, we'll go back to dark chocolate. I'll go over to the milk chocolate. Chocolate-covered Rice Krispie treats. Here's the milk chocolate. And then here's the other side of the dark chocolate. Maybe the orange cream. Okay. Mm. I'm not sure what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get something though. You're looking at some of these dark chocolate raisins. Get some if you wanna try it. Dark chocolate raisins, try some. They have about everything you could imagine in here. Getting, getting you some? Yeah. I made something the Check out these chocolate. They got little verses on them. I wonder if they got a Matthew 1926 verse, like my tattoo. That'd be really cool. I'd for sure buy that. I feel like we got to get, what is it, just ready? Oh, just milk scripture bars? Mm -hmm. This is pretty awesome. There's John 316. Scripture candy, is that what I said? Mm -hmm. We got over here. Some interesting facts in 1925. That is a huge peppermint patty. I don't know, I'm gonna get something maybe some kind of dark chocolate thing out of uh, the case up here. What's it say? Uh, we ship. There's fresh fudge. I don't know the pricing of everything up here in the in the. Oh, there, it's by box. Okay, so a half pound is eleven ninety seven, and a full pound is twenty three ninety four. Chocolate covered Twinkies. Rice Krispies. Um, what shall I get? I don't think I can eat a half pound of chocolate. And we're going to go do some other stuff, so I don't really want it to melt in the car. So. I don't know, because I do know, like.
Man, there's some good looking stuff in here. Look at the pecan tops. I think I'm gonna come back over here to the wall and look at some stuff they have over here on the wall. Espresso beans. I need to show Timber that, she loves those. Something I missed earlier, dark chocolate alligator. And if that one's not big enough, how about one with eyes? Oh God, that is cool. Look at this golf set. I think of everything around here. Life's a beach. I'm gonna get something that's got like, uh, they did say the pralines. What do you got over here? Here's the good, not little, I guess that's huge, but. A lot to show in this place. Oh, there's the potato chips. And pretzels. Pretzel rods. I found the pralines, so I think I'm gonna try a praline because it said try our famous pralines. So we've got a praline, you've got your chocolate covered raisins. I think that's what we're gonna get today. Fresh fudge is ten dollars. And I think we're gonna get a um I am not a fudge. Are you not? No. I ate fudge way too it's, much. It's, <laughs> it's really rich. Yeah. I think we're gonna try chocolate covered strawberry too. So they've got milk chocolate, which I'm gonna get a milk chocolate, and Timber's gonna get a dark chocolate. We're gonna try both of those. And then you'll come over here and pay. Oh, hey. Look at this. Oh, I saw those over there. Can oh. we get some? Yeah, we can get a couple. And as we're heading out, the bag says it's always a sweet day. And that's what they tell you when you check out, too. They say, have a sweet day. Have a sweet day. Back outside. I think we're gonna walk back to the car and then um, try these. Back in the car, got the air blasting because it is kind of warm today, but we're both gonna try these. I got the milk chocolate. I was gonna get dark chocolate, but I wanted to try something different since you've got the dark chocolate, so. Do you like milk chocolate or dark chocolate better? It's 50-50 for me. Here it is. Is that yours? Mm -hmm. Cheers. Ah. <gasps> Cheers. That is very good chocolate. Wow. What do you think? Mm -hmm. That's good stuff there. Mm -hmm. I do have to say, it's a little messy though, as is chocolate in Florida. Very good though. Those are delicious. Next. Oh my. I mean. Massive. Raisinets. <laughs> Huge. Got this praline. Here's the ingredients. There's the ingredients with the praline. Good. You like it? Yep. Trying to open my praline, I can't get it open. Not much dark chocolate I don't like, so. Whoa! Very rich. Woo! Very good. No way I can eat all this right now, but that is tasty. The consistency's really good with it, too. Get a big one. Yeah, it's about. They're all big. That is good. That is really good, actually. Definitely need some milk with it, though. Oh yeah, those are good. Those are, that's really good dark chocolate. All right, that was our trip out to Angel and Phelps Chocolate Factory here in Daytona. Definitely worth a stop. If you're looking at places to go to while you're visiting Daytona, even if you're coming in the fall time like we just did, that's a fun place just to go in and look around and even see their little chocolate factory. I'm glad it's like a free self-guided tour. Use tour kind of lightly because it's just kind of watching them make it but really cool place really cool that it's a christian place they had little prayer request cards which was awesome um and the chocolate was amazing mm -hmm. and the strawberry was amazing going back in there i would for sure probably get a chocolate covered strawberry every single time and if you have more people you could even get the box of chocolate or if you're staying in daytona on vacation you get it and take it back to the hotel room we just didn't want it to melt in the car because things were already melting as we were eating them but everything was good mm -hmm. So I think that's gonna wrap it up here from Daytona. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.